Agents, assemble! Get to the universe ready for space travel! Binky, a first agent cat. Five pets will save the world in fact. Team first, they're on the case. Find all the data from outer space. Cuckoo for Cuckoo Clock. I can't wait to see how this thing works. Hmm, that's strange. Cuckoo Clock should only cuckoo on the hour. Maybe it's broken. Old clocks like these are antiques, and sometimes they don't work quite right. But the good news is, they can be fixed right up. Where are we gonna hang up the... <laughs> clock? Before we hang it on the wall, we need to figure out why it's not working properly. Probably just needs a good cleaning. But first, that yard needs some serious raking. Come on, we'll deal with the clock after. What do you guys think it is? Maybe a fancy litter box? Oh, oh, oh! I hope it's a new storage facility for my treats! Mm, yummy yumpkins! It kind of looks like a very tiny space station. Lou's right. Look, it has a roof just like our space station and even a little door. So cute! Hmm, if it is a space station, then what? If anything, is living inside of it. I'll get to the bottom of this. Ahem. Hello, neighbor. Wakey, wakey. <laughs> Why is there a bird living in that mini space station? Better question. Why is there a mini space station living in our not so mini space station? Why does it keep doing that? Oh, I know what's going on here. I'm glad someone does. That bird in there is an undercover worst agent. <gasps> and clearly, its name is Cuckoo. Why would a worst agent be in our space station? And what do you think Cuckoo is planning? Hmm. Yeah! That is one loud worst agent. I wonder. We have four first agents living in this space station. Hmm. Oh! Then maybe there are more worst agents than just Cuckoo living in that mini space station. That's good thinking, Gordon. Birds of a feather stick together. Where there's one worst bad birdie, you can bet your beak there's more. Worsty, shelter, undercover us. Code name, uh, ticky birdie thingy. Those loud cuckoos will drive the humans and us to abandon the space station forever. That's cuckoo bananas. Oh, forever sounds like a really long time. Don't worry, buddy. We won't let that happen. I'm not gonna let Cuckoo, or any other Cuckoos, live in our space station. This is a mission for first. Ready for space travel! 
I cannot believe that Worst was able to sneak an agent into the space station. Right under our noses, too. Do fish have noses, Lou? Step away from the merchandise. <laughs> we need to get that bird out of here before it's too late. How are we going to do that? I think we should set a trap. The next time Cuckoo pops out, we grab him. Good plan, Agent Pinky. Agent Gordon, kindly get some gadgets that will help us capture that. <gasps> now it's just mocking us. In pounce position, Captain Gracie. And I'm ready to net this bad birdie. Agents Nola and Lou, are you in position? We were hatched ready. Classic Lou. Ready to swoopy scoop, Captain. Agent Gordon, is that new purse device ready to go? You complete me. Oh. <clears throat> Agent Gordon? Huh? Uh, um, the purse issued KG containment cage is ready, Captain. And now we wait. And wait. And... Let me guess. Wait? I think Cuckoo knows we're waiting for him. I think you're right. Jeepers. We'll need to trick him out of the mini space station. But how can we out-trick that tricky bird? Hmm. <gasps> Birds of a feather! Remember? Fantastic thinking, Agent Gordon. We can trick Cuckoo into leaving the mini space station by showing him another bird. Of course. It'll think it's a worst agent. I hate to be a wet blanket, even though I am a fish. But there are no other birds out here. Not yet. You look so good. How humiliating. Dressing up as a fish's worst enemy. Ugh. Thanks for taking one for the team. Your bravery and sacrifice won't be forgotten, Agent Lou. <sighs> That's what I'm afraid of. Tweet, tweet. I'm a wee little bird. Wee! Wee! Lou is really good at pretending to be a bird. Yeah. Show us your stuff, Lou. Oh, brother. Huh? <coughs> tweet, tweet. Wee! Why isn't this working? Put a little more tail feather into it, Cuckoo Lou. Mm-hmm. There has to be some information in here that can help us. Hmm. Aha! That mini space station is what humans call a cuckoo clock. It tells them the time. Cuckoo named his mini space station after himself? Ah, what an ego on that guy. What do you call your gadgets, Gordon? Gordon Gadgets. Why? <clears throat> oh! According to the manual, when the hands on the clock face are in a certain position, those chains and weights will move, the little door will open, and the undercover agent will emerge right into our trap. Let's get cuckoo for cuckoo clocks. <laughs> I love my job. Agent Binky. It's okay, Captain. I needed to wake up anyway. Yeah! <laughs> tweet, tweet. Uh, I mean, tweet. I want to be bouncy too. Yeah! <laughs> I'm okay. Is a tricky foe indeed. Not on my cuckoo watch. Purse power! <laughs> cuckoo! Uh, I mean, gotcha! <laughs> Great work, team. <laughs> agent Gordon, please remove the worst agent from this space station. It'd be my honor, Captain. Great job, agents! Oh! The humans! They're coming back! Hide! Great 
great job with those leaves, bud. Now let's see what's up with this clock. Hmm, the hands are on the hour, so the clock should be working. Maybe it needs a bit of help. <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Whoa! Ah. Whoa, what's happening? Ah. Now the cuckoo bird isn't even singing. Strange. This thing needs more than a good cleaning. Let's take this to someone who knows all about antique clocks. Grandpa! Yep. He'll know how to fix it and make that birdie sing again. Come on. Oh. Ow. Good job, Agent Lou. We have cleared the space station of the threat. Hoo hoo. <laughs> ah, don't worry about that, alien. Gordon sent that pesky worst agent out into space where he belongs. <laughs> Just doing our job. Robo pests. That's a nice, happy nappy. Oh. What was it? Oh. Get out! Huh. Alien on the window! Flittius, Flavius, codename Butterfly! Yeah. Gordon, window alien! Gordon, look! Safety caller engaged. Oh no! Jeepers! Sorry, Binky. I got him! Honkin' hairball! Sweet sassy starburst! it nicely. Hey, that's not yours! First power! Woo, 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 woo. And stay out! Thanks. It was getting citrusy in there. That was super weird behavior for aliens. Who knew they were so handy? We're lucky the humans are away for the day. I say we get some answers. All right, alien, talk. Oh, wait a minute. That's no butterfly. It's some kind of gadget. But who made it? What? I made them myself. I also make feathers and cupcakes. Professor Koo! Koo! Squawk! And Chirpy McChirp, the bad budgie himself. Sorry to bug you, house pets, but there's plenty more robo-pests where that came from. Right, Professor Koo? Koo! What are you up to? Being the worst. And having a birdseed break. Stay focused. See you soon, pests of the universe. <laughs> hey, it's pets of the universe. I feel like he knew that. So Worst has an army of robo-pests, and they're fast. This is a mission for Burst. Thing. Not really aliens. Fluttering everywhere. My nappy was not happy. I was all, whoo, 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 and they were all like, whoa, settle down, agents. 
One at a time. Chirpy sent a swarm of these robo-pests to raid the station. They flew off with knickknacks and doodads. Furry fuzzbutt. If it keeps happening, the entire space station will be taken apart, and we'll have nowhere to live. And neither will our humans. Should we call Sergeant Fluffy for backup? Not on your kibbles. We're a team of first. We can make those pests bug out all by ourselves. Front of space station clear. Over. Back of space station clear. Over. Side of space station clear. Over. Keep up the good work, agents. Over. I doubt they'll be back. We really showed them who's in charge. Robo pests, on your paws. <laughs> no bearsies, fly lower. Huh? <laughs> oh. Here comes the SWAT team! Now, fish sticks. Gotcha! I said gotcha! Oh, oh. Well, that was, how you say, easy fleasy. Chalk! Bye, bye, bird brains! <laughs> huh? Wait a minute. Where are the birds? Oh, right. Uh. We need to track down where the robo-pests are coming from. So we're bringing out the buddy bot. He's the best tracker we have. You got the set boy? Do you? Do you? Go get him. Down, buddy. I was holding the robo-pest for a while, so I guess he smells me. <sighs> Incoming! On it! If we can't stop the robo-pest raids, the space station will break apart. Then where will we go? And where will we put our humans? Oh, I really wanted to handle this on our own. But we need extra paws on this one. This is Captain Gracie calling for Sergeant Fluffy. Why, hello, Captain Gracie. How are things at the station? Um, fantastic, sir. Everything is possum. <laughs> That's not true. Things are bad, sir. Normally, I'd never bother you, but we're having trouble with robo-pests and... Robo-pests! I'm on my way! Thanks for lending a paw, Sergeant Fluffy. Always happy to help, Captain. This robo-pest rabble has bugged us before. We always have to work together to beat them. Great! How do we do that? We need to find out where they're coming from. I had that idea. You sure did, Captain Gracie. That's because you learned from the best. Now, I think this will help. That's bird seed. Those birds are bound to go after that. Exactly. And we're going to let them take it. So we're giving them a gift? That sure is nice of us. Aw, but I didn't get them anything. Can that be from all of us? No, no. There's a tracking device on the back of the bag. So once the RoboPests take it, we just follow the signal to Chirpy and Koo. All we have to do now is wait. I didn't take long. They're headed for the room of many boxes. Agents, on your paws. Mm, seeds. Uh, Professor Koo, we're here to snatch parts of the station, remember? But, but seeds! We have a mission. But seeds! All of this dusty treasure could be ours! Yeah, but, but, but seeds! Ugh, fine. Take the bird seed. <laughs> they took the bait! Now, all we have to do is follow them. Safety caller to engage. Pets of the universe ready to ride! There they go! We're hot on their robo tails! Oh. 
<laughs> mine! It's all mine! Special delivery for you, Koo. Why, thanks, Koo. Don't mention it, Koo. Help! Pretty bird! Hey! Yum! Birds of a feather share together? Squawk! Let's pounce them! Wait! We have to take control of that Koo computer. Nola! Lou! Nab it with that Gordon gadget! Fish eye on the prize! Agent Gordon, can you operate this? Easy fleasy. Wait a sec. What's that? Relax, it's just the robo pest swarming. <laughs> swarming? They got the controls. Whoa! Uh -oh. Hey. Gordon? <gasps> Who's a fluffy wuffy puppy? <laughs> We're just dropping by to get back the stuff you took. Your plans to dismantle our space station are over. Oh, yeah, Chirpy just wanted that stuff for our clubhouse, but wrecking your station works, too. Hey, you shouldn't take stuff that doesn't belong to you. That's the last of it. Well done, agents. We couldn't have done it without your help, Sergeant Fluffy. Oh, everyone needs help sometimes. And you should never be afraid to ask for it. You never know when someone might know something you don't. And the sergeant knows pretty much everything. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs>